This is U1FTP, allowing you to connect to your Ubuntu One storage as a network drive in Windows, on Ubuntu, on Mac OS X, and on other platforms. So, this is Windows, and as you can see, we can go to James Hentridge's website, or we can go to launchpad.net slash U1FTP, and download the zip file. Now, when that zip file downloads, you can then run it with Python. So, as you can see, you download U1FTP 0.1, and then you start terminal and say, Python U1FTP 0.1.zip. At that point, you're making Ubuntu One as a whole available to your computer. You can then connect to it as a network drive. So, in computer, say at a network location, and then choose a method, and then connect to FTP 127.0.0.1 port 2121. Then, when you connect, uh, for the moment, say log on anonymously, and then say next, give it a name. So, call it. U1 FTP or Ubuntu One Storage, whatever you want to, name your network drive. Windows will then ask you to add a username and password. Use your standard Ubuntu One username and password, so the same one you use to log into the website to log into Ubuntu One Music Streaming. You can then say save the password if you want to. That will then connect. At that point, when Windows is now making your Ubuntu One file storage available as a network drive, so you can browse around it, look at it, do whatever you want. So that's now connecting, and as you can see, that's now connected. That's showing your Ubuntu One file storage as a network drive. So you can browse into it, browse into the Ubuntu One folder, then browse into images, and you can see the images that you've got in your Ubuntu One file storage available on Windows. Uh, if we go to the Ubuntu One website, you can see exactly the same files there. So if we go to one.ubuntu.com, browse into files, and then into images, you can see exactly the same files. They're files in your network storage, in your personal cloud. So you can copy files into and out of that. Uh, so here's an example of copying a file in and then pasting it. Because your Ubuntu One storage is available as a network drive, you can do anything you want with it. You can copy all the files into it, copy files out of it, rename files, move them around. It's a really convenient way of getting access to your personal cloud without having to install the Ubuntu One synchronization client if you don't want to. So as you can see, that's now uploading, and that file, Hydrangeas, is now stored in Ubuntu One. If we switch to uh, the website, hit refresh, you can see that, that file is right there in the personal cloud. So this was Ubuntu One U1 FTP, available as a network drive. We hope you like it.